Hey there guys, Remus Online here. There will be no strat sat today, I will explain why at the end of the video, but to fill the void, I'm going to show you the set I've been running with my Vivian. You've already seen it, I kind of did a no narration video, but I'm going to narrate this one to explain to you what's going on on screen. So my opponent needs for Hydreigon and Suicune, I've got two bug types on the field and this was to provoke a fire type move from one of the two Pokemon he had that could deal fire type damage. He actually chooses the Hydreigon, so I go for a plus one priority powder which deals 25% of the opposing Pokemon's HP as damage when they try and use a fire type move and I was predicting the Hydreigon to be specs as well. So. Suicune sets up a Tailwind, I wasn't too worried about what it was going to do that turn because I knew it couldn't get the KO on anything and I go for the U-turn on that slot and I'm able to switch into my Sylveon. The reason for this was to try and force the Hydreigon out because he's locked, I was quite confident he was Specs locked into the fire move. I do go for a Protect here, um, again I was predicting the Hydreigon to switch out, not wanting to deal with the Sylveon but it seems as if he didn't have anything in the back to take a Specs Hyper Voice. He does give it the Scald, and as you can see here, the ability Friend Guard, which I run on my um, Vivian, which is the Hidden Ability, allows Sylveon to take basically no damage from that Suicune. I don't know if the Suicune is invested at all, but I'm taking no damage from that. Look at that. Uh, that wasn't even 30 HP damage. And uh, yeah, that was a stab scored, and I'm not actually running any special investment at all, as in specially defensive investment. As you can see here, Terrakion comes out, goes with the Iron Head on my Sylveon. I don't know what item it was holding. It could have been Choice Banded. I don't know. All I know is that thanks to Friend Guard, Sylveon lives the turn. I'm able to set up my own Tailwind, predicting him to want to go for a Rock Slide and maybe a Scald onto the Vivian to try and take it out. Um, I wanted to get a Tailwind up. For a worst case scenario, when his Tower Wind ends, I'll be able to outspeed him. However, he just doubles up on the Sylveon. Sylveon does not get KO'd because of that Friend Guard ability, and I'm, I'm able to knock out both his Pokemon with a Specs Hyper Voice. And his last Pokemon is Rotom, and he knows he's not going to win because Vivian's at full HP, Scissor's at full HP, Sylveon's not at full HP, but, you know, you, 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 you might kill a Sylveon, but then you've got three other Pokemon to deal with. <coughs> Excuse me. So yeah, um, you can see this set on the left hand side of the screen, it's a bold natured Vivian with 252 HP, 252 defense, and 4 into speed to maybe get the speed creep on something, I don't know, I just didn't know where else to put those um, points. I run Struggle Bug, and that is as a way to avoid being taunt baked, but it also allows me to deal a form of damage if, if Vivian for whatever reason was my last Pokemon and my opponent was at like 1 HP, I need a way to be able to finish that battle off. It also allows me to lower the special attack of the opposing Pokemon, which is really good when combined with Friend Guard, because it means my Pokemon can be taking special hits for days. Powder, a great move, don't, don't know what it is, Bulbapedia it, but basically, it's a plus one priority move, and it will attach itself to the target, and if the target then uses a fire type move that same turn, it explodes in their face, dealing 25% of their health, in as damage. Tailwind is there for speed control and support. I do have an alternate Vivian which has Electro Web, which is a move to the move as a Tailwind. But uh, a Tailwind is a lot better because it sticks around on my side of the field rather than them switching out to get rid of it. I'm protecting the last slot because with the Friend Guide ability, I want my Vivalon to stick around for as long as possible. And I usually have the Focus Sash on the Vivian. While I am running a bulky build, Vivian does not have that much defense or HP, so it can get O code quite easily, even with the investment. So I'm still looking at maybe I should change the investment because if I'm not going to live a hit and I have to use a focus sash to live a hit, why am I running bulk? Uh, so yeah, that is Vivian. It's not really a guide. I just thought I'd show you guys my set. So if you like the set, give it a thumbs up, like, favorite, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next video on Monday.